Hey guys, it's me Lisa Smar. You are going to be entering my kitchen today. It's been a while, so be prepared. I know last time was on stream, but a lot of you don't have Twitch, which you should definitely get Twitch so you can interact with me live weekly. I've been streaming typically three to four times a week, sometimes even more. Lisa underscore ASMR on Twitch. Come check me out. Anyways, I'm going to press you up against the coffee maker. And we are going to make Hello Fresh's black bean and blue corn crunch burritos. Hmm. Yes, I'm a vegetarian. Fancy, fancy. Okay, so I'm not going to use all the ingredients because I don't like spicy stuff, but I'm going to rinse the tomato. Something I saw online was if you have a wet paper towel and you're going to be cutting onions, which I am, if you use it, it should soak up all the acid so you don't cry. So this is the apron that Christopher aka the boss gave me and I'm using pots and pans from Brian. So. Thank you both. They are both lovely and I love using both so much. And let's see. I am going to dice the tomato. Oh, sorry, you can't see that, can you? Let me get you closer. Bada bing, bada boom. Let me fix you really quick. There you go. Okay, get that little part off, get that little part off, okay. oh juicy. <laughs> Sorry, I was listening to the offspring before I started cooking. I need to sharpen these knives. grab the measuring cup and get three-fourths cup water for the rice. Alright. I know it's wobbly, but it's three-fourths. <laughs> Gonna pour it in the pot. Okay, so I need to combine the rice. Oh, I should have put the rice in first.
calls for salt, but honestly, HelloFresh always calls for salt all the time. And I need to stop using it, I'm just saying. But sometimes it can be too salty. All right, so I need to bring it to a boil, then cover and reduce heat to low. Cool. So, da da da, the cilantro was bad because we didn't cook it in time, so that was on me. So I, I'm not reporting that because obviously it's not their fault. Um, there's the tomatoes. I need to do the onion. I need to peel and finally chop the onion. And the onion's right here. Oof. This be looking rough, I tell ya. <sighs> Honestly, I should have cut it this way. I wasn't thinking. Yes, I can technically still do that. Okay. Outer layer off. It's stuck in my head, just that part too. Oh, rice is boiling, I need to put the lid on top. That's what I do when I get a song stuck in my head. I start doing da 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 trying to get it out of my head. I gotta say my eyes are a little bit burning so I don't know how well this freaking paper towel thing actually works Ooh. 
Cheese up and some cream. drizzle of olive oil. Is this pepper with me? No. Oh, I mean you have all these pieces. I'm great for the hiccups. of oil in a medium pot of medium high heat. Add remaining onion. What? Uh, <laughs> all right. In a bowl, combine the tomatoes. Two tablespoons of onion. I'm not a big fan of like uncooked onion, so I'm only gonna do a very tiny bit, honestly. I really don't like uncooked onion. Or raw onion, I guess I could say. Oof. I can't add cilantro because it wasn't good. <laughs> it was spoiled. Mm. 
not going to add the jalapeno because I don't like spicy stuff. Alright, so I'm going to heat it for some medium high. Okay, so I'm going to separate small bowl for my sour cream with a squeeze of lime juice, season with salt and pepper. Okay, I'll do that later, but I'll go ahead and, well, I'll cut that in a moment because I want to be able to scrape the onion in. So I like to like move the pot about, get that oil running around. Easy way to check if the oil is heated is by taking a little bit of water and spritzing it. And if it sizzles, it's right. It's not really sizzling, but honestly, I don't feel like waiting. So, that's supposed to be cooking technically with the jalapenos for like one to two minutes. Oh, and let's see. Pinch of salt. Literally has salt on every step. It's not really Adding the beans, block beans more. Ha 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 ha. Then it says these beans are good until January twenty twenty four. Who knew? I love the smell of cooked onions. Alright, and then we will take the black beans. Let me double check. <laughs> and yep, add the black beans and a little bit. Not bad, but like 
it all the way through, I guess. It is a shroom stock. Interesting, interesting. I've actually used it before. And the other Hello Fresh meals. The extra protein, you know. And then salt and pepper. It says bring to a simmer. It is boiling, but let me stir this really quick. Just to simmer for like five to seven minutes until reduced. Now you can see the steam, huh? All right, so let's see. I need to still fit the line. When I used to work at a uh, restaurant, that's how you cut the lemons for the drinks. Fancy, fancy, I know. Um, bum, bum, bum. Using your hands, break half the tortilla chips into bite-sized pieces over a medium bowl, and keep the rest whole for a serving. Nah. Oh, that's supposed to be like a sauce. Oh, okay. I got you. Alright, so I'm just gonna put the fresh tortilla chips here because why not? the sour cream salsa. I need to heat up my shell. Put a little bit of lime in it. And then we are going to I told you salt and pepper literally in everything. Much 
pepper can make some spicy. Alright, so I'm going to stir that up. And I'm most likely going to have to put some water in it because it said it wants a drizzling consistency. And that is not drizzling at all. And I might have added too much water. And luckily I have sour cream in the refrigerator. Well, I mean, I do have a fork that I'm using, so goodness gracious, Lisa, get it together. That's basically liquid. All right, I'm gonna get add some sour cream. Everything over here, you guys. Add a little bit more. Alright, I think this is the consistency it wants. do to heat it up is I put a wet paper towel over there. And I heat it for 15 to 20 seconds if it's just one tortilla shell to make it nice and warm. You don't want to squeeze the wet paper towel dry because then you'll have a dry tortilla shell. Takes away the purpose of having a wet paper towel. And then you just divide everything and voila. So I'm going to show you everything. Um, sour cream drizzle with lime juice in it from fresh limes crunched up tortilla shells or tortilla chips sorry the raw onion and tomatoes that's supposed to have cilantro in it and the bean and onion mixture that's supposed to have jalapenos in it with the um and it also has shroom stock and then the lovely rice oh i made y'all condensated mwahahaha actually i'm gonna leave that over here Thank you all so much for watching. So much love. I hope you enjoyed and learned something today. Much love. Bye.